Solving algebraic equations using algebra tiles is very similar to solving algebraic equations using scale. The first step is to write your equation above the vertical line, where our vertical line or our scale represents an equal sign. And now we have two sides to our equation. We have the left side and the right side, which is very similar to the left side and the right side of our scale. Now the next step is to write the left side and right side of the equation using the tiles. So I'm going to write 4 plus 3x using algebra tiles. To represent the 4, we're going to use 4 red unit tiles. And we're going to place it on the left side of the vertical line. To represent 3x, we're going to place 3x tiles on the left side of the vertical line. Now on the right side, we have negative 5. To represent negative 5 using tiles, we're going to use 5 blue tiles. As we did with the scale, we wanted to determine what one of those x values was equal to, and that's what we're doing to solve. In order to determine what one of those x values was, is equal to, we must somehow get rid of or eliminate those four red tiles. So how do we remove those four red tiles from our equation? Well, using tiles, if I add four blue tiles, each of the blue tiles and each red tile becomes zero. So one blue plus one red is zero. Negative one plus one becomes zero. But whatever we do to one side, we have to still think of the scale. We must also do to the other side to balance out our procedure. So I'm going to add four blue tiles to the right side of the equation. Now, what happens to these tiles on the left side is that they become zero. So they're eliminated. Now, the next step is to determine, well, what does each of those x tiles get for each of these blue tiles? We're grouping. So each of these x tiles can be grouped with three of those blue tiles. So now we have our equation, and we solved it. x is equal to 3. Let me write down our answer below. And that is the solution to our equation, x equals 3.